Welcome to EWN on the couch where we catch up with your favourites both on and off the field and today we're actually on the field again, the UCT Green Mile. Um, I'm sure if you're a sports fan you've come across the debate rugby versus American football, which is better? Well today we actually got to see some of the draws from both sides. Uh, Michigan State University was here and some of our Springboks. I've got a Pima Gianti on the couch with us today. Welcome, thanks for joining us. Thank you for having me. Thank you for having me. Oh, having yeah, I know you've had an off week now but how are you feeling? Feeling but refreshed after your super sure, rugby yeah. break if I can say that? Very good, very good, feeling very good. I mean, had like had some time to spend with the family, so I'm really it's always good. Yeah, always good, always good. Okay, then today I saw you guys. I know you guys didn't participate as physically uh, with the, oh, with we the did. folks. Oh, we did sorry, it. I do apologize. No, okay, how was it? Do you see the, these? these um, I want to say NFL players, but they're not there yet. They're, that's a level up, right? So they're yeah, American yeah. college football players. Yeah. How was that? I mean, it, like it's obviously a very uh, different. Yeah. Uh, you know, like experience, but really refreshing. Like at the same time, you know. I mean, I want like it's something very different. I mean, for me, and as you could see, I mean, for them as well. So what did the Oaks ask you? Because like they were like in depth conversation. We've got Arches name and yeah, also somewhere, but they yeah. were like intensely asking you guys questions. What did they? What was the typical question they asked you? Okay, so for them, they don't understand the whole thing that guys like. Why are you guys not wearing pads? <laughs> Because they're like, wear guys' helmets. You're like, wow, well, that's kind of like for sissies. What rugby? Like, you know, like, <laughs> oh, so was there a bit of banter? Yeah, there was. Is there it? was. I mean, I mean, I mean, but I mean, all in good. You know, all good spirits, uh, yeah. I mean, all in good spirits. So, was know? the pads? I don't know. So, so gear. pads and contact continuity. I think that's the biggest difference between, yeah. in, I mean, uh, American football and rugby. Yeah. That in rugby, there's continuity. So, if there's uh, like a collision, we, I mean, we form a rack, there's a breakdown, and then we play from there. Then, as soon as there's a collision, stop play, and then they have to reset again. Then they can take off the whole team. I learned, and they can put in another team. You know, so it's just yeah, those different put dynamics. Yeah, because they've unlimited subs. Yes. Would you say rugby players' endurance or stamina is a bit better than an American football player? Yeah, yes. I think so, yeah. I think so, oh, But yeah. what do you think they, they have maybe, I'm not saying better, but different so, skill level? Yeah. I mean, I mean, having said earlier on, I think there's a lot we can learn from yes, other, I mean, from sure other sporting codes. I think especially in American football, you know, they're very structured. Like, I know their like skill level, like, like their specific skills, right? Yes, yeah. and like everyone, I mean, they, I mean, there's specific detail for yes. everything. Like literally, if you're a kicker, that's all you need that's to focus on. Yeah. And, the, and, the, and that's your job, and you become good at that. If you're a quarterback, you become good, I mean, good at that. And I learned that if I played in NFL, I would have been a running back, you know? So, Interesting, and I, yeah, all right. So, I mean, so you need to work on your evasive skills and running and, agil and I mean, agility, jumping yeah. and all of those different kind of components, you know? So I think that's one thing we can learn, especially like, uh, as I said, I mean, they're very, they're very detail driven. You can even see physically, like they, the, they, the big oaks are big, big and the small oaks are small. Then, There's yeah. no middle ground. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's no in between. And you, you know? and a rugby player would be more all round, right? Yeah. yeah. So, I, so I think, I mean, based on that, I think, I, like, I mean, I still choose rugby over NFL. You know, that was my next yeah, question. Would you, you know, ever I, consider? Yeah, because I mean, as a rugby player, you know. Um, you are able to be in the breakdown. You are able to do. The, I mean, the, I mean the, the physical stuff up front, and as well, you're able to do uh, the running as well. Yeah. You know, and to score while well, probably some of their O's can yeah. even score the defenders, right? Yeah. If I'm not mistaken. Yeah. yeah. And then in terms of uh, okay, we're talking about the skills and stuff. But do you think Rassi will be adding any of this to the Springbok camp upcoming camps? <laughs> Well, we just have to wait and see. <laughs> we just have to Maybe for some suggestions see. there. Huh? Well, from the stuff that they did, you know, I don't think I'd be suggesting any of the stuff they did. Really, eh? Yeah. So, <laughs> you know. Rugby wins. Okay, we play a little game we call Just Be Honest. Just Be Honest. So it's only yes or no answers. Oh my gosh. Ooh, I need to be honest. You can be so honest now. I think we can do it. You can honest. do it. Okay. okay. Would you ever move overseas permanently? Yes. Is a tree of lucky underpants? Is that? Is a tree of lucky underpants? No. Do you think South Africa's accent is the sexiest in the world? Do I think South Africa is? This accent or the sexiest in the world? Definitely. 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 <laughs> Listen to Jacob Zuma. Wow. <laughs> Amazing, guys. Okay. Would you ever act in a superhero movie? I'm a very shy person now. Okay. Are you the prankster in the box team? Am I? The prankster in the box team. Prankster. Prankster. No, Quaha. 
everyone I'm getting the it. truth. We said be honest. So, Apiwe, thank you so much for joining us on the couch today. And all the best for the Super Rugby season and for the upcoming big year we have in rugby. And we wish you all the best. And thank you for being so honest with us today. <laughs> Apiwe Gianti, you know where to follow him. A big year for rugby and maybe American football. I don't know. They were here. Maybe we'll go. <laughs> so maybe some of them will come here. Hey. <laughs> Thanks for joining us on the couch.